Hey, Lux here, and what did they do to this game, dudes? Juan Soto, um, they made him psycho, okay? 109, 105, with 125 power both ways. Vision, 92. Speed is his, uh, one downside, I guess, along with, like, you know, his arm. Reaction is good enough at 76, and then on top of it, they gave him active quirks. Right? They gave him his dead red rally monkey fighter situational hitter first pitch unfazed. The only one he's missing is the breaking ball hitter. So you throw a fastball to this guy and it's it's going places. Now he is very expensive, 222 right now. We'll take a look at the pack uh right here. It is we could show let's take take a look at the odds. We'll buy them both, but one out of ten chance at getting the top round, which is Soto. And if you thought you were impressed by Soto, take a look at uh Julio, who came in second place. Also, 98 speed with over 100 contact, 124 power both ways, arm 92. Like, yeah, sure, he's got bad fielding reaction, but, man, you uh, you can kind of deal with that with 98 speed. Like, sure, he'll get, like, some false steps and everything, but you are going to hawk down some cards. It, this might be the best card in the game right now. I'll have to see it and take it out on the field myself to kind of, like, uh, test and be sure, but, oh, Oh my goodness, like, this is just, like, it blew me away how good they made him. I really thought they were going to make these guys in, like, the 90s contact, maybe 80s for some of these lowest ones. Pete Alonzo here, again, um, very similar to his card last year, 122 power. Um, all these cards, you know, everyone we've seen so far can easily get up to 125 just by paralleling a few levels. Here's your your, your first base, and if you need a right-handed bat there that's not named Frank, sure. Um, contact's a little bit lower than a lot of the best first basemen, but it's something you kind of got to deal with. Albert Pujols, um, plays first base with zero speed. Hilarious. 120 power for him. Um, uh, surprisingly one around. Schwarber here, 117. He did not get catcher secondary. Big sad right there. Uh, left field, right field, first base. So maybe a little bit once we get down to these levels, um, Maybe a little bit less like on the usable side, but 117 power is, is just going to carry, especially in the the uh, home run derby event we got going on right now, well, the moonshot as they call it. But Jose Ramirez and then a switch hitter with 115 power. It would have been really, really cool if Jose Ramirez could have gone farther. If, like, dude, if he would have got one of the final two cards, that would have been an end game third baseman, right? Like, it, we're, we're seeing, like, you know. Maybe not end game because they're not five tools, but like a third baseman. I guess you don't need a ton more like fielding than what, he, what we've got right there. Um, and then if he would have had his contact and power as a switch hitter, that would have you know been right there with uh, Chipper for end game. So Acuna right here is decent speed, decent fielding, and uh, okay stats there for contact and power. And they're all mega usable. Oh yeah, Seager I forgot here too. Uh, uh, a middle infield with a ton, not a ton of speed. So really the big shockers were this Soto card, which just is jaw dropping in my opinion. Um, especially because of the quirks that we got right there. Julio Rodriguez, as we know from earlier, doesn't have his, uh, the active quirks kind of like the superstars have. Um, like so Acuna with his uh, active quirks, breaking ball and dead red, will even play above what he's got right there. So. Man, I'm going to try and buy it. Let's see what we can get out of it. Uh, let's go ahead and open it. Oh, we got a lot of packs. Conquest and stuff. Grinding it out. I'll probably do maybe a video tomorrow or something uh, on uh, what what the been done so far. Did I lose it? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Home Run Derby. All right. One out of ten chance. We need all of our YouTuber luck right here for a top round. We got a base round. So we are dead inside. Let's take Ramirez. I do love switch hitters. You know that. Let's try it one more time. Come on, come on, come on. One out of ten chance, one out of ten chance. Big money, big money. No whammy, no whammy, no whammy, no whammy, no whammy. Stop. Ah, okay, mid-round. Not nearly as good, man. We were just, just almost made it. So let's go ahead and take, I, I guess, third. Pugos goes for more, but Pete Alonso is a better card. I guess I'll just buy the other ones, right? Let's just go ahead and go out and buy the other ones on the block let's take a look at those prices i wonder if the prices of these cars will go up like are we gonna get these packs maybe in some sort of like rewind going down the future um so it might be worth just like grabbing them uh or at least i'm gonna grab them but uh, that's me like these things are already oh, wrong one i was like those things are already kind of minned out but i already got those so let's let's go ahead and put in some uh buy orders for them Thir 13 5 2 7 
Okay. Okay, it's sold to me. Let's do... So I got Pete. Uh, no, I don't have Pete. I had Pujos. Buy, create buy order, 20, zero, zero, 001. I don't know. Do you think these are going to be profitable if, if uh, we grab them? Man, I really don't want to grab at this price. But, like, what's the supply, right? Like, what more supply is there out there? There, there really isn't anything. Buy, create buy order, 212. Let's go ahead and try out Soda. See what he is. Oh, I'm getting jumped like crazy here. Create buy order, 212. So we got whatever, dude. What's the point of stubs if you don't use them? Down to 664, though, with those orders in. Yeah, these things are just, like, jumping all over the place. All right, Soto got sold to me. Let's go ahead and put an order with Seeger, Ramirez, create buy order, 13, 13, 3, 6, 5. Yeah, I don't know if I, I don't know if I love the uh, in, investment in these things right now. I think it's like, like, what else are we going to get? Like, let's think about that one. F uh, let's think about that. Like, let's really think about what are the investors. Sold it down to 190. Oh, I'm majorly overpaid. Majorly overpaid. Julio Rodriguez. We'll see. He's going crazy, though. Um, I don't know. Well, like, uh, this program's done. All-Star Packs tomorrow? Could we get Home Run Derby Packs tomorrow? I'm not sure we will, though, right? Will we get more Home Run Derby Packs? Can't be that way, right? Julio Rodriguez. People are still overbidding me on Julio, which is a, a big sad active order. Got down for two two one two. Julio and Pete. Alright, now I'm just kinda like rambling here. Um Oh man, mine would have sold. Great buy order. Two oh one. Yeah, I would have got it sold to me, wouldn't I have? Uh oh look, look at that. I just saved eleven thousand stubs. Um, yeah. Let me know what you guys think. The for the investment. I I I actually don't hate the investment of these cards. Since I, I don't know of another path to getting them. Um, maybe... No, 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 We might get them on this all-star program on the 20th. So, Wednesday afternoon. Moments and missions unlocks play, player items and packs. That, may, that would make sense that we have all-star game packs and home run derby packs in that program. Maybe that's the time to invest. If we get a, If we get a pack for free out of that. Which I would assume we would. But you never know. Good luck out there. Good luck investing. Uh, doing what you got to do. Um, looks like we got them all. I'm going to try and I'm gonna play some uh, some more event here and keep it going. Um, so good luck to everybody on the grind. No matter what you're doing, what you're grinding out. That's it for the video. Please subscribe to the channel. It really helps it out. Peace.